Cervical radiculopathy can be caused by many things. Um, most commonly we see this happen when you have degeneration inside the joints of your neck. Um, we also see it happen if you have bulging discs, which are the little cushions that are in between each bone in your neck. Sometimes they'll move or get pushed out and kind of add a little extra pressure onto the nerves, which will set off those symptoms that we talked about earlier. We have poor posture, we have an injury. Um, these discs can what we call herniate or bulge, and that causes them to push out against the nerves that are coming out of our spine. Um, and that can cause the pain that you feel and the radiating numbness and tingling into your arms. Um, this can also happen from a traumatic injury which throws off the alignment in your neck and can compress nerves causing you to feel those pain and symptoms that we talked about. So what do you do if you think you are suffering from cervical radiculopathy? It's really important that you address it early on when you first start feeling those symptoms. You don't want this condition to get worse because you are dealing with nerves and prolonged nerve damage can cause a lot of problems in the future.